What is going on everybody? This is Nick from NDR Game with a division video where I will be going over how to best optimise any build for PvE and PvP. One of the things I have encountered since the division was released, it is difficult for new players to the game to know how to optimise your gear high enough to not get completely destroyed in the dark zone and in high PvE missions. So what I thought I would do is a guide to what attributes are the best ones you need and what are the most important if you're not lucky to get a god roll item. I will also be telling you what are the highest stats you can go for up to on 256 gear. So you know if you could still farm for a better pair of gloves, if you think you are too low, etc. I would recommend deciding what gear set you want to aim for first, before changing any attributes so you make it as high as possible. Okay, well let's start by going over the chest piece first. The highest stat you can get on a 256 gore chest piece without any mods attached is 3266, which I currently have not seen one this high yet which on my alpha bridge build is just under 3184 so even i could still farm for a high chest piece to make my build even stronger for the major attributes i would always make sure you have at least armor rolled on this item but if you are lucky enough to get both health and armor in your major attributes then you could roll the minor for ammo capacity or try and max out your armor and health if you think one of them is too low next is the pack pack which has a max stat without any mods of 2,293. For the major attributes, again, armor is the most important. Make sure you roll up for this in calibration. But if you feel you have enough armor and you could use more skill power, you could switch out for that instead again. If you are lucky to have that specific attribute already on your gear, you could try maxing that out or rolling for ammo capacity on the major attribute or maxing out on either firearms, stamina or electronics instead. Next item is the mask which has a max stat of 1001. For the major attributes I would go for health if you don't have it already rolled but if you are lucky try and get enemy armor damage in the minor also as this will definitely help you out a lot in both PvP and PvE. We now have the gloves which have a max stat of 1001, same as the mask. The major attribute for this is assault rifle damage right now for 1.5 as they are the go-to guns right now. And for the minor, critical hit damage and critical hit chance. If you are lucky to get two out of the three like I did, then you can roll out for the last one and have a decent gear set in your set. We're now onto the last two gear items, which are the knee pads and holster. So for the knee pads, the max that is 2,931. For the major, I would go for armor as the most important. Then if you are lucky to get that already on your item, then I would roll out for enemy armor damage in one of the miners. Last but not least is the holster with a max stat of 1,674. Major attribute I'll have is armor first, then if you're lucky, try and max out either firearms, stamina or electronics. There you have it. That is my recommendations to optimize your gear attributes for any build you decide to do. As for what to have for each of the mod on your gears, that is totally down to you. If you want a powerful firearm build or a tank build, electronic build, etc. I personally have higher toughness than my DPS so I can last longer in PvP encounters. If you haven't seen my Alpha Bridge video, I will leave a link for it at the end of this video, just in case you don't know what build type to go for. For the last part of the video, I thought I would show some additional clips of my optimised build in the Dark Zone. I hope you all like it. If you do, don't forget to hit that like button and as always, don't forget to subscribe also if you want to see more videos like this in the future but that is all from me today thank you all for watching you are all awesome catch you next time warning now entering dark zone warning we have dismounted a vision this action will mark you as rogue
Transmissions jammed. Proximity coverage only. Backup activated. System rebooted. A rogue agent has been neutralized. Till extraction complete. Ready to bring it on board. <laughs> 